Yo, 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 it's your boy Gabe. We're back again with another video. Okay. <laughs> Is it good? Can you yeah. see it? It's on. YouTube, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Wilco, back with another video, and today we are. <laughs> what is up, my athletes? It's your boy Gabe. <laughs> oh, damn. It's Wilco, baby. And today we're talking about how we stay motivated. Go All right, uh, so motivation, guys, is something that's really tough because a lot of people, like, a lot of people go off what they feel. A lot of people choose their behaviors off of what they feel. They'll say, you know, I don't want to work out tonight, I'm not feeling it. Or I don't want to get my schoolwork done today, I'm not feeling it. And a lot of people judge their behaviors off of, you know, how they feel and how motivated they are. And it's tough because it's something I've struggled with for a long time. Um, throughout high school, I struggled with depression because of this. Like, I, I struggled with, you know, really just saying, you know, like, whatever. I'm going to do things anyway. So, we're going to get into it a little in a little, little bit. Have you ever had a dream that, that you, um, you had, you, you, you could, you do, you, you want, you, you could do so, you. In a little bit more detail, <laughs> in a little bit more detail, but that's basically the gist of it. Um, motivation's tough, man. Motivation's tough to find. Um, it is. But it's something that you just gotta, you just gotta kind of look for it. You just gotta push through, no matter what you're going through. <clears throat> All right, well, so when it comes to working out, putting on these games, how do you stay motivated? Well, what, what drives you to go to that gym? If I'm being honest with you, there's a lot of nights where I don't feel motivated, but, you know, the things that, the things that do motivate me are first, you know, you want to see results, right? Yeah. So results are number one. Number one. Um, number two is just the mental aspect, right? So you got to think, you know, working out is great for your brain, and it just puts you on a different level mentally. Um, and three, I mean, I don't know, man. Just like that, that's basically, I don't even want to, that's all I really have to say. Um, just working out, man, just changes your head. It makes you feel different in every aspect. It'll make you feel better. You'll look in the mirror, mirror and you'll feel better about yourself. And you'll, I mean, I sleep better after I work out. Like just, there's a lot of different benefits and you'll hear that from everybody who works out. So that's, that's basically the main things that really motivate right. me because I, I, I think about like, okay, this is how I'm going to feel if I work out. And that's really where I get my motivation from. But I mean, also there's like dumb things too. Like obviously you want to look good for like, you know, we're all men here. Like, you know, you want to look good for girls and stuff. Like there's obviously little things like here and there. Um, but you know, that's, that's just a little like, that, that doesn't matter in the long run, but that's basically it. How about you? I, I don't ever want to go back to how I was before. Yeah. Well, oh, yeah, because like yeah. you've come so far that like, yeah, I don't ever want to go back, and I'm never going back. So that's like my motivation. Um, and how I, how I view it, if I, if I miss a day, or if I don't go to the gym, <laughs> it's one step closer to 260. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to go back yeah. to 260. Yeah, so for sure. that, that definitely keeps me motivated. And making a schedule, having a set schedule, and just sticking to that schedule that, you know, it, it, it literally helps you stay on track. And, you know, it just keeps, keeps me motivated. Yeah, and I can, I can kind of piggyback on what you said with like um, like missing a day because there, there'll be days like that, that. That's actually something that motivates me a lot is I'll think like, okay, what happens if I don't go tonight? So like, I'll tell you one thing. It's going to be hella easy to do anything, whether it's schoolwork or going to work or working out. It's going to be hella easy if you, you're in the mood for it. Everything's easy when you're in the mood for it. Yeah. What determines your character and how you grow as a human is what you do when you're not in the mood for doing something. So Facts. when it comes to the gym, there's nights that I don't, I don't want to be here. Like, I'll be straight up. I don't want to be here. But, you know. You got to push through. Yeah, you think like, okay, like what happens if I don't do this? Like what happens if I take a night off and I wake up tomorrow, I'm going to look in the mirror and I'm going to see like, you know, I'll, I'll notice like that I didn't work out the night before. I'll notice if I didn't eat enough the day before. Like, just like, you know, you don't do your schoolwork and you get a zero on something and you fail your your classes that you're paying for like you notice that so you know yeah. you think about what happens if I don't do this let me just get it done I don't care that I don't want to do it like I, it doesn't matter that you don't want to do it get that shit done and move on to the next thing then you can do the shit you want to do if you if you're in the mood to sit in bed and watch Netflix go do that but get your shit done first it don't matter if you want to do it or not it's all about behavior no, but, that's facts that's facts because there's a there's a lot of days where you're not gonna want to go to the gym 100%. And, and 
Those days are what define me. If I <laughs> only went to the gym when I felt good, I'd be a fat <laughs> fuck, I swear to God. But like there's headaches, there's stomach aches, there's pain that you'll feel that you just gotta push through because those are the days that are going to define you, not the days where you feel good. It's like a relationship. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. yeah you, you know, you, you're with a girl, but everything's going good. Ah. It's it's really but the minute easy. you guys start arguing, the minute shit hits the fan, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That it's, defines a relationship because you guys gotta push through. And it goes with anything in life. Yeah, it's like like I just said, man. It's really easy to it's really easy to do things when you're in the mood. When everything's going well, it's gonna be easy. And and honestly though, don't look at that as a bad thing because when things are going good, ride the momentum. Like ride the nice. like ride that shit. Like Appreciate oh wait, pause. It. Wait a minute. Wait wait a minute. Hold wait. First of all, you're not gonna speed past that. Like you didn't just say what you just said. Oh. <laughs> Ride that shit. <laughs> nah, but um, you ride that shit. <laughs> wow, I really said that. Um, <laughs> look, like when 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 motivation's high and like you you have momentum, like use fly it. The kite. Use it, yeah, yeah fly. Right. But there's yeah. gonna be days when you're down. Listen, you're gonna feel down sometimes, but you gotta get your shit done. So at the end of the day, that's the most important thing. Yeah. That's what's gonna define you. And for those for those like I, I I have a really soft spot for people who deal with depression because I dealt with it for probably three to four years. And that's what depression is for me. Like that's the kind of depression that I went through where I just didn't want to do anything. I just let my emotions control me where I was just in the mood to just lay down and watch YouTube and watch shows and do whatever and just play video games nonstop. And you know, there's there, everything's good in moderation. Like you can do a little bit of this, a little bit of that, but you gotta balance out your life. And you know, that's how you get out of depression is pushing through those feelings and saying, I'm just gonna get my shit done. And that's how you push through it. And that's how I've pushed through it this last year or so. And now I'm finally out of it and I'm starting to learn new things. So listen, if anybody's going through that, please, honestly, if you need to talk, hit me up, I'm down. Um, Gabe will put my Instagram or whatever, but I'm always free to talk to anybody, I, 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 that's fine. Um, so yeah, that's just, I, I have a really soft spot for that. and. Um, that's kind of just how you stay motivated and that's how you get out of that shit is just push yourself through your feelings and find find any kind of motivation you can latch on to. So. Exactly. Progress, even if it's little progress, it's still progress. 100%. Exactly. And you have to appreciate that too. Even the littlest W's in your life, appreciate yeah, the, the littlest the W's. Take the smallest wins. I bet the first five pounds you lost, you were Ooh. like, oh my God, I lost Boy, five pounds. I was like, I got a six pack. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly, but, but that's, yeah, that's how that's W's. That, that's how it works. You got to take the small wins because eventually it'll just it'll just translate into a big W. You know what I'm saying? And then you go up from there. I remember I saw my first. It was a cut in my arm. I was I was in the mirror. That's kind of like how I am now. Yeah. I see like the littlest cuts. I like the. I was like, yeah. and then I put it down. <laughs> you feel like you're Arnold Schwarzenegger. Whew. Yeah. And then I was just chilling, and I saw a cut in the mirror. I was like. All right, <laughs> all right. And it just rode the wave. It just kept going from there. Yeah. And that's just that's how it works, though. You have to appreciate awesome. when you're at those levels because that's what motivates you to get to the top. That's facts. Yeah. He used to miss a lot of days. Yeah, Let's be real. Oh uh, yeah, he, when I first started working out, he yeah. used to miss a lot of days. Yeah. And it was because of that, man. Like you feel tired, or like you just mm -hmm. don't want to go. Like that's that's how it was. Like the first probably two to three weeks of me working out, that's kind of how it went. Yeah. But now at this point, I just played a hockey game. I just got my. But, you know, I'm about to hit a, hit a light workout after this, so you know. <laughs> what's the point, bro? Well, when, I, when I say what's the point, what's the point? What's the point of doing all this shit? What's the point of working out? What's the point of I mean, at the end, a better version of yourself? At what's the, the end of the day, that's, that is what it's about. It's about bettering yourself, but, you know, it's about climbing the mountain, bro. That's, that's, what, that's what it's about for me, at least. Um, and that's my main motivation, just waking up every day and feeling like the best version of myself, so. Why be average yeah. when you can be great? Yeah, so I think that's something a lot of people, you guys can relate to. Um, it's just climbing that mountain and becoming yeah. the best version of yourself. And right that's that the wave. most important thing to me, so, yeah. Right, that wave. Yeah, you, you always want to be the best version of yourself. You weren't put on this planet to be average. You were chosen. You were born. Why? Why just be average when you could be great? That's what you got to ask yourself. Make sure you guys follow us on the Instagram. It's one underscore one ninety seven. Make sure you follow Will Cough. Will Cough underscore two B's two underscore. B's. And uh, if there's anything you guys want to see, yeah, comment, comment like stuff for us to do. Like we have ideas and stuff, but please comment stuff to do. Yeah, whatever you guys want to see.
down and do whatever. We'll do whatever. <laughs> Jesus, game. <laughs> Make sure you guys like, subscribe, hit that freaking bell button, and stay motivated. Stay motivated, man. Stay motivated. You know, Moss, one more. Just keep going. It only takes one chance for you to blow up. All right. Like if you're a rapper, it only takes that one song to blow up. You know what I'm saying? Like my boy Will. Make sure you guys hit him up on Apple Music. Will cough two B's or just one B? I'll send anybody but Apple Music. Man. All right. Well, whatever. Hit his. Hit his sound. We'll, we'll talk about that. We'll, we'll talk about that at our time. But, I, I gotta work on my stuff. Just keep going, no matter what it is. Yeah. We are out.